Glow. <laughs> it is the black top 10 11 the fam of course mike j milan lambo hey he is here welcome hey 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 what to do what hey, the man. business is what's going That's, on man how you doing brother another week another week a beautiful week too like this weather can popped out everything i'm enjoying it all word mm-hmm. yeah man yes we're glad to have the Lambo parked in the building, ladies and gentlemen, because we are about to get ready for an epic conversation. Ooh. And tonight's conversation piece <laughs> is, well, uh, you know, I actually, you know, it's interesting. Lambo brought this in the group chat. <laughs> I had posted it this past weekend. So it's just like the inevitable that it was going to happen to talk about this tonight because the conversation is dating older Dating younger. Mm. What do you prefer and why? You know? Now, I ask that because, um, you know, as you mentioned, Milan, we've seen a lot of this. Yeah, lately in the news. Yeah. In entertainment. Now, it ain't like it's it's not normal. Right. So, it, it's, it's definitely been happening, so. Yeah. So, I mean, I ask this question. Um, do you prefer dating older or younger? And if so... Whichever one you choose, why? And you know, actually, we'll open up the phone lines that in case you want to guys want to chime in. Yes, please call us and give us your opinion. Yes, 814 267 0361. And let us know do you prefer older? Or do you prefer younger? And why? Now, I got some answers on Facebook. I'm going to get into them a little later, but let's start okay. with us. And I'm going to start with Lambo. <laughs> <laughs> So the question is, sir, of course, <laughs> do you prefer older or, or younger? Definitely older. Really? Yeah, definitely older. Um, I'll be real with you. Like, I feel like younger people, they, they need a little bit too much attention on their hands. Yeah. Like, they I need a little you. bit. They need somebody to hold their hand through so much on a daily basis. It's just, oh, my God. It's, it's almost, I don't want to feel like I'm raising another kid, you know? And I feel oh, like that same. you are really kind of needy. So, same. Yeah. Yeah. I ain't even gonna lie because older guys are needy too. So, I can't even. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. I mean, I mean, it could go either way for a female because, I mean, most of the time we mature faster than y'all anyway. Yeah. So, I, I mean, I would prefer someone older, but. I mean, when you say younger, right? Because I'm not Drea, right? What's the range? <laughs> like, I, I, would, I wouldn't go find somebody like that age, like 21 or 22. Like, that's outrageous for me. But, um... Hmm. So you wouldn't be a cougar? Nah. 20s at my age? Nah. That's that's extreme. I wouldn't date But do you not think age. that people could be possibly mature? I mean, yeah. If they had... I, I would somebody that I would say is probably mature I wouldn't even a guy in their 20s I wouldn't say I wouldn't consider him mature until he was like 26 27 like you would mm. have to be somewhere near there for me to even mm. look at you and be like mm, I don't know I don't know <laughs> but I don't I wouldn't no cause I mean yes realistically like I don't want to feel like I'm raising a whole nother child 
and it goes differ yeah. a lot of times within the age range or this age gap you know when you were still in your 20s you can swear that you want to settle down right you know when you're in your 30s you might know you want to settle down yeah. and have already accomplished the things to do so you know mm-hmm. so a lot of times in your 30s you are already set to settle down you really right. do want it when you're in your 20s you kind of ride in the fence you can go one way you can actually go the other that way facts. you know like ah, it's just too sticky yeah. of a situation and then you're in your 20s somebody gonna sell you the settle down dream while you in your 30s and before you know it they gone in a flash mm. yeah I can't like I'm not going with you to the club like I've <laughs> been there done that I'll explain that to somebody been there done that <laughs> I'm, I'm definitely not doing that. So um, you got any games on your phone, <laughs> right? Like <laughs> real snack cabinet. That. Like come on, bro. Now you in there eating my son's snacks. Like <laughs> you're out of control. <laughs> <laughs> now I mean, I so so. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> I just think you know. Now I I have met some women in their early twenties. Okay. Who are very mature. Well, oh, I didn't finish my thought. Oh, so you, you're right. Ahead. You're right. I I will say certain people in their 20s, I would say they would. Most people that hit a maturity level early usually have been to college. They have some type of discipline, right, like right, right. some type of structure within their life. I will say. Yeah. So someone like that could possibly be a little bit more mature than your average regular on the street just chilling. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. So that's the exception. Yeah, I mean, you know, plus, you know, like, I mean, I know in my family, like, we were raised by, like, older, older parents. Like, my pops is now, like, in damn near 80. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, like, they raised us to be very uh, mature adults quicker. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A little bit more sounder. A little bit yeah, more. Yeah, you was chopping wood at five. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, you chopping well, with damn, changing right? carbonators. Uh, what is it? Paul Bunyan it too, huh? God damn. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I you know, it's just I'm I'm not saying Okay. I think I, I do realize what people say. Now I'm about to be thirty five, right? So that's like you're in the middle. Cause you could go cougar. <laughs> or yeah. you could be a sugar daddy a little bit. Yeah. You know so you could, you could date the mom and the daughter. Yeah, there at this you go. Age. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What? <laughs> Daughters is 18 out here, 20 out here, whatever. That sounds like a Lambo move. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, <laughs> wait. I mean, but you know, I particularly prefer five years. And like a five okay. year gap. Like five, no That's more, fair. more than five, no less than five. Number one, I think, you know, we can relate on a lot of things in that gap. We have a lot of things in common you know what i'm saying i feel like women are younger you know they don't know how to go to sleep so you know women is- <laughs> the outside i like naps you know what i'm saying i, mean, I, I really like, i like nap i got insomnia. <laughs> there you go yeah. <laughs> so i mean you know it's just plus you know somebody like fresh out the house like 21 or eight like yeah you're not gonna take them seriously, so to no, say. No, not she's she's definitely going live crying and telling all y'all business. <laughs> For sure. For sure. <laughs> she is. <laughs> yeah, that maturity thing is 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 key for me. But I've met some women who are older than me and the maturity rate. <sighs> they trying to keep up with the young girls these days. Yeah, I mean, I think I don't know. I think with women, it's weird because they see these guys, like most older women see these guys, they go for these younger girls. So they feel like they got to compete with them. Mm -hmm. And it's crazy because most of the time, the older women have way more to offer. They just more put up so they don't look appealing. Right. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like the world is changing, though. I think like the fad of everything that was so like taboo that everybody fell in love with over like I don't want to say COVID but within the years coming into COVID yeah. it's slowly like easing out like the BBL thing and the mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying mm-hmm. I think it's more it, it'll essentially go back to like those girls who are in the house or yeah. you know it's, it's kind of that way now you hear that you hear guys saying they want that but then they still go for the girls who not in the house so it's weird 
I don't think guys really know what they want, to be honest. Uh, and y'all sitting right here and nobody got an answer. So I, that I, answers I, that question. I, 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 I don't want to go there. <laughs> so I actually got one of these answers that I want to read. Um, <laughs> this is very interesting. Check this out. So shout out to Nikki Nicole on Facebook. <clears throat> she says, I prefer mature men. It just so happened that I met someone 18 years younger God, Lee. than me. Cold hmm. stuff. <laughs> <laughs> what you, don't, 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 don't support that. I just told you I could date the mama and the daughter. It was an issue then. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's, it's more men than it is. I mean, it's more women than it is men. She could have passed. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> she says it's been one of the best relationships she's ever had. We've been together for four years now. Our, Go, girl. Our age difference is not a factor in our relationship. Well, that's good, especially when you can find somebody. Like, I think it could work if you find somebody that you really have legit common interests, hobbies, common ground. Like, y'all enjoy the same thing. I think it could work. Yeah. But let's also throw in this, because <laughs> I'm going to get a little raw. <clears throat> okay. Sex. Plays a factor in this. Okay. Mm. In what way, though? I mean, because you got to think about these women. Like, they be in their 40s. Like, that's supposed to be their prime. Okay. So, of course, they going to want them young bulls out here. You know what I'm saying? To come through with the come through. Okay. So, you see a lot of those cougars. <laughs> they suffering now. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff swollen up. You know what I'm saying? You know, because cause men in their 40s, <sighs> trash. <laughs> garbage yeah <laughs> i mean ain't enough blue chews and honey packs <laughs> yeah they just it's crazy they didn't start getting they made wings out of that shit they, <laughs> that shit is crazy what are you guys into <laughs> honey pack wings big, big bro honey, big honey pack <laughs> like come on when did you <laughs> like Tickle me out, my wet ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Plus, a lot of those men dealing with midlife crisis. And, right. You know, they're changing physically, you know, lose, you know, confidence is a thing now. Yeah, you know? I think. Sex plays a factor. Yeah, it get Oh, I mean, because don't nobody want to do the same boring two step every every time you go out. You get what I'm saying? That's like you go to the club, you do the same dance every time you go out. <laughs> I don't want to go to the club no more because I know we are gonna do that same line <laughs> dance we do every time we come here. God, right? <laughs> they gonna play Meek Mill every time. Yeah. Right. So yeah. what do I want to keep coming to this club for? Right. They <laughs> always playing Dream Tonight, man. Right. Now your club is bored. Right. <laughs> no more admission. It's hey, shut man, down. Right here <laughs> literally <laughs> literally <laughs> so what do you want me to do with that <laughs> that's true you know what i'm saying Plus, there's no excitement like i think older guys have to realize too and oh we i we I, I just had this conversation this week uh -huh. i think older guys get complacent like because they are such providers Ooh. that they don't they don't actually feel like they have to give the effort anymore because they are doing all the providing Mm. And I think that's the problem when it comes to dating older guys or more mature guys. Because when you get somebody who's who's doing those manly duties like that, that they should be and most women expect, it, the relationship starts to stale out and get boring because they're so routine and they don't throw in anything spontaneous. Yeah. So I, I could understand why an older woman would want a younger guy because, mm -hmm. I mean, I'm either going to put your head between the washer or the dryer <laughs> or you're going to give it to me and pipe me down it, amazingly, right? <laughs> it's going to be exciting. It ain't going to be flatlined. All the, it's gonna, it's, something's yeah. going to happen. Yeah. So I, that could be the excitement with it. That's why I feel like Keisha Cole out here in these streets, like and, the way she is. Andrea. You know Andrea. I mean. And Bernice. And that could be and true. Larsa Pippen, and Brittany Renner. Can the list go on? You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, well, I mean, there's another factor in that too because we got young millionaires out here. They feel like okay, which kind of uh, it kind of okay. upsets me a little bit because it's like, dang, like you couldn't find a millionaire that was around your age. Like you can't hit up To or you know what I'm saying? Like, but you know what? Why? It, should, it shouldn't. Have, it shouldn't. Have, <laughs> Why would you do that? It shouldn't, it shouldn't upset you because <laughs> these kids are the clowns. You know what I'm saying? Like you can. First of all, Jalen Green could have multitude of women him just being a basketball player accolades whatever being attractive you chose that particular person yeah so i don't feel sorry for you because when you get caught up in the rope you know what i'm saying you get done dirty then 
what happens after that? You knew you knew better. You had a whole world on your hands. That's so, true. so you're saying yeah. we should not shame nah. these women for um, I know most people say they praying. Why why on hate on somebody guys, who got the power to do something? I don't feel like they're praying. I feel like these are our adult people. I hate that word because it, to me it's not a pray. He, he he's he's an adult. Okay. I think the reason that we use this word pray in this term it's because of the fact that, which is the question that I ask, it's the dynamic of guy to girl and girl to guy. Because if the roles were reversed, older man dating younger woman, the word pray would be thrown around a little bit Ooh, more. Okay. You okay. know, it would yeah. be used way more. Lo- stock, stock syndrome, Stockholm syndrome would be thrown around a little bit more. Mm-hmm. He's He is trying to love bomb her into the way that he wants because he's at a certain age and has that at hand so now she is mesmerized but at a certain point now we're looking at it like he's a manipulator right you know so when it comes to the degree a lot of guys are probably using that because of the fact that it's like older lady she's doing the same thing this older man was doing with a younger you know I mean yes it it is really messed up how the how the the tables kind of teeter depending on which side it is oh absolutely I mean Either way, however you put it, it sounds crazy on both ends. It's just a little bit more acceptable on one end than it is the other. Normalized. Right. Yeah. I mean, well, you have to think about it. When I when I literally go back and think about it, my grandma was, what, 15, 16? My grandpa was, like, 19, 20 when they got married. Mm. And see, so, yeah, this has been going on. Right. Yeah, absolutely. You know? Absolutely. Like, so I guess that's why it's not so taboo because that's that's what... I guess it's it's only considered taboo because of the thought of the equality being so much in the forefront of this new generation. This standpoint right. is like, you could do it, I can do it for everything. So mm-hmm. when a guy feels sort of slighted about his options of being able to do these things, mm-hmm. knowing that a woman has had that chance and has been championed for it, it, make, it probably made the guys feel some sort of way as far as, you know, the comment sections. And this is, it becomes an uprising within it and a debate mm-hmm. within it of gender. It's always a gender bait. Yes, Whatever we is. do is going to be a gender bait about everything. I don't, of course. I mean. <sighs> I just, I just, mm, I just know for, mm, for me. Like, I could never just go too young. Just, no. Yeah, just too young. No, is that's crazy. crazy. Too young is crazy. Like, yeah. I think my probably no. lowest would be 30. Damn. Like, I want to meet your parents. You but, 30. <laughs> I was kidding. Mm-hmm. Like, I want to meet your parents, but not because you live with them. <laughs> yeah, know? yeah, yeah. Exactly. I want to yeah. meet them not by force. Right. <laughs> shit, you shoot. Sorry, <laughs> I ain't. I ain't even mad if you live with them because the way this economy set up, I mean, we all on Cody. We split this four ways, baby. <laughs> where y'all stay at, man? At her parents' house. <laughs> y'all own that yet? <laughs> hey, Mama, what you cooking us? <laughs> we the heirs. We up next. <laughs> <laughs> right. I feel like that's how you got to do it. The way this man. system going nowadays. I ain't mad at that. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Now she really bragging. Y'all don't win out. To the most expensive is restaurants because y'all ain't gotta pay no bills. No, you don't. <laughs> I no. mean, that could be smart though. Look, you know what I'm gonna say, why are we hating on people who got the power to do these yeah, things? Yeah, right. Exactly. I mean, it's actually a power move. So, I mean, the Mexicans doing it. The I me- mean, the they Mex- do. They just build. They buy the house and just build, add I sections mean, uh, onto it. Look, <laughs> Jer- Jersey Shore. No, I'm saying the Italians do it too. Absolutely. I mean, I don't see the problem. Cousins be in the basement, your grandpa in the attic, yeah. your parents live in the rooms, you know. Everybody saying? putting in, I mean, that's cutting the cost for why not? Why not do Charlotte it? Charlie in the no chocolate saying. factory. Hey, that's what you know what that is what it remind me of. <laughs> <laughs> that's just wild, man. But I mean, you know, it's it's um preference wise. Yeah. Not to say that anybody that's in their early twenties can't be mature, but just just off rip. It's just not going to keep me interested. It's not appealing. Yeah, no. Nah. Yeah. I, I think my lowest is definitely 30. I but then you get all of that at like somebody that was like, <laughs> mm. do you tell us a story like <laughs> seasons ago Probably. about a guy that came in your DM and he was like, <laughs> he was 19 and he shot his shot. And he was like, you know, so I what's can't. your goals in life? I can't. I, I I feel like I do remember, yeah. but you know, it, this is this is on the episode. So many, y'all. yeah. Y'all gotta go back and what. I can't remember. Yeah. I I remember, but I can't remember exactly what happened. But, but he was like nineteen. 
Oh. Yeah, I mean that's happened a couple of times though. Like oh, even Jesus. some my little some of my little brother friends, I'd be like, "Kill y'all are outrageous!" <laughs> like I literally watch you get on the elementary school bus, like you're tripping. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with that's you? That's how it starts. <laughs> <laughs> like what? Man, shoot, some of them nuts drop as a man. As a like, man. sir, no, you still don't <laughs> have a chance. <laughs> I used, I used to lust, lust after my math, math teacher. I, ain't, I swear for shout to Miss Allen. <laughs> Not shout her out though. Oh my God, I still, Allen. still want that chance. <laughs> <laughs> that ass was fat. <laughs> I used to love sitting up front row. <laughs> Please open the lines and get Miss Allen on the line. When I tell you, I got straight A honor roll in that class, boy. I, I'm horrible at math, but at that math class. <laughs> One plus one equals you and me. <laughs> <laughs> you so <stupid. laughs> But let us know, ladies and gentlemen, what you guys out there prefer, okay? All right. Are you out here being a sugar daddy? Or are you out here being a mountain lion? Or a sugar mama. Uh, you know? Mm. Ain't nothing wrong with that if you got the funds, baby. Mm. I'm you know just getting my cradle robbed. That's all I know. What? Uh, <laughs> I'm the baby in this situation. <laughs> I'll always be that. Shout out to my dad. My, my mom and pops, they 10 years apart. So. I mean, that's not bad, though. It's not. But then at, at the same time, you're like. When did they meet? When did y'all meet? <laughs> but that's, that's what I'm you know what I'm saying? It's not, it's not, Jesus. It's not bad you when get you're older. older. Depending on oh, where you're older. at. Okay, right, right. But right. when right. you say I'm 19 and 29, that's kind of like, <laughs> Right. Hold Depending on, on where you're at with it definitely matters because you cannot be 10 years older than me at 15. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> that's kind of weird. But. Are hey, you 25? You'd be like, what? 25 exactly. and 15? Exactly. That's, that's crazy. Mm, shout out. Shout out to Dog Kelly. Uh, <laughs> but let us know, ladies and gentlemen, what you guys think out there. Man, and subscribe to us, man. YouTube, Blacktop TV, man. Let us know. We'll be posting these episodes this week.